Welcome to Casa de My House. This table was handcrafted by hearing impaired Indonesian women. And this chandelier features 162 free trade blood diamonds. Come on, let's see the rest of the house. It's really big, we're really rich. You're gonna love this. Ah! Oh my god. Damn it, Deathwish! I told you to put the pipe wrench back when you're done breaking people's toes. Psyche like expects a torture chamber to clean itself. <laughs> embarrassing. Oh my god, do you guys want to see the bathroom? Tonight, I am throwing a dinner party for the release of my book. It's called I Know What You Did Last Summer and That's Why I Married You, The Heather Bradford Story. The book is about my life with my husband, Death Wish, one of the greatest slashers of all time. Ah! <sighs> Silly. Go get ready. Okay, boo-boo. The constant fear of death really keeps the marriage spicy. I'm not a possession, but I'm often possessed. I met my husband when I was 13 during a game of light as a feather, stiff as a board. Cliff, not the burgundy. It was love at first psychotropic cohabitation. Cliff, you should try these. It's really delicious. Cliff is a total foodie. I live for fresh baked cookies and the love of our Lord, Satan. I love to bake! I've perfected an edible blood frosting. It comes as close to the real thing as you can get without being real blood. <laughs> I would never use real blood. That would be illegal. Right? I think it would be illegal. Wouldn't it? I don't know. Yes. Illegal. Coming through. Oh. Do what I told you. Oh, the goat's blood enema. No. Everyone who's important to me is gonna be there. The ladies, their husbands, their poltergeist. Hey. Oh. Oh. Yes. oh my god. How oh. are you? I didn't know any better. I'd think you were pregnant. Oh. I get off on hurting people through gossip. Where's the uh, death wish? You know what? He had to dispose of another body. Yeah, I'm gonna miss the party tonight. I'm really sad about it. Speaking of handsome husbands, I really haven't noticed if Tucky's gone on a killing spree lately. I, did I just not see it? My husband Tucky used to be one of the greats. Ten found dead in a factory, twelve at a Christmas party, twenty at an orphanage. That was back when he was a living toy doll. But as Tucky got older, he decided he wanted to get to know the real Tucky. It's moist. You, you like it? There's a Japanese moss, cocoa. Oh. I've been working with it. It's the same kind. Oh. Some kind of consistency. Turns out the real Tucky really loves Japanese gardening. I mean, I know that's a one kind, but I'm really busy. Hey, Foxy Roxy's in the house, and she's present, and she's here. Roxanne showed up to the party already wasted. Could I trouble you for an autograph? My wife is a huge oh fan. Oh my god, of course. I don't need a man to kill for me. I was sort of best female serial killer of 2004. I'm sort of like Dexter, but sexier and more vagina-y. Heather! Oh my god, Roxanne! Hi! Oh, hey, thank you for coming! Of course! It just makes me so happy that you're finally doing something with your life. Oh my god! Heather and I are besties. I hate that It's so good to see you. So good. Excuse me, um, are there any more cupcakes left? Oh. If you would love to try one. Darling, I'm so sorry they are all gone. That was the last one. That Yuri, she really gives me the heebie-jeebies. Oh. It's not just because she's Asian. There are other reasons, in addition to being Asian. Thank you guys for coming tonight to the release of my book, I Know What You Did Last Summer and That's Why I Married You, The Heather Bradford Story. It has been a tough transition, going from hot teen virgin to hot wife virgin. But it's been... <laughs> I'm still talking. Hey, I also have a huge announcement to make. I wrote the introduction to Heather's book. Surprise! Another surprise is that we're sharing the cover. Fucking You're welcome. I hate it when two white friends fight. Who do you root for? You know, it's like South versus South. It was all working out. I was about to kill that fucking 
Heather, you uh, should kill me. It'll help you with your book sales because I'm so famous. <sighs> and then I realized I can't kill that fucking because that fucking is my best friend. <sighs> oh my god, thank you so much for not killing me. This party got so lame. Thankfully, Gary saved the day. That sassy spirit fucker. He's so much. I don't want a fucking cupcake. Leave it to your A to make the whole thing about her. Hashtag face eating. Where's my eye? Oh Lord, Satan, help me! I'm gonna eat your friends.